Over 3.1 million citizens in Albania have been called to vote on May 8 to elect the mayor of 383 local government units, who are mainly racing under the logo of two major coalitions, the Democratic Party-led Alliance for Citizen Coalition and the Socialist Party-led Alliance for the Future Coalition. According to Albanian authorities, these elections are held under the best infrastructure, with full digitalized and transparent voters list, and with 2.7 million voters being provided with ID cards and the rest with legal identification documents. Prime Minister Liberisha considered May 8 a festive day for this country's democracy and called all political forces to contribute to a normal process and accept the verdict of each vote of Albanian citizens. After voting at Borough 2 in Tirana, Berisha invited all Albanian voters peacefully to do their duties as citizens and vote for the candidates they believe will change their lives in the next four years through their devotion and integrity. I invite Albanian citizens to vote calmly and in a dignified manner and I assure them that this governing majority is committed to fully respecting the vote of each Albanian citizen, Berisha said. On election day, the ruling majority candidate for Tirana mayor, Rudzim Basha, also extended a message of wishes to Albanian voters. I am convinced that this will be a good day, and I wish a calm vote not only for Tirana citizens but also for all those across the country, Basha said after he voted at Borough 8. His chief socialist rival, Edi Rama, who is running for a fourth term in office as Tirana mayor, invited citizens of all over Albania to vote to determine their future. All voters believing in the power of the vote should have their own say as free citizens about the high electricity bills, process and endless lies of the government. The 2011 local government polls are the six successive polls held in Albania in around 20 years of political pluralism and are considered by the internationals a test for democracy in the country. They will be monitored by around 5,370 local and foreign observers. The latter are mainly part of the OSCE ODIR and the Local and Regional Authorities Congress of the Council of Europe. Lanes Lenarcic, OSCE ODIR director, arrived in Albania on election day. Following a meeting on Sunday before noon with President Bamir Tobi and Deputy Prime Minister and Foreign Minister Haji Nasto, Mr. Lenarcic considered May 8 election significant to Albania.